Sikato village in rural Angola. Nobody wants to be late for school. It's exam time. Everybody wants to succeed. But it's hard. There's a shortage of books and paper, and the mud walls of the school are crumbling. But that's set to change. The Angolan government is rebuilding the education sector, literally. At Sikato, parents are busy with the brickwork, with funding from UNICEF and technical help from an NGO called People in Need. The architect explains the philosophy. Nós aqui não estamos aqui para construir a escola própria. A gente está trabalhando com as comunidades e o resultado desse desenho é a construção dessa escola. Government, UNICEF, NGOs, parents, everybody is working together to build safe, durable schools. Albano Natal wants a better future for his three children and for himself. He's a farmer, but his newly acquired skills might help find him a job on a construction site one day. With his wages, he's bought new clothes for the children. Teacher Antonio is one of hundreds benefiting from new in-service training, just part of the child-friendly schools concept, putting education at the heart of development. In focus areas across the country, UNICEF is assisting the government with better teaching, better facilities, parents' involvement, and brighter hopes for the future. Nós queremos que é o nosso futuro brilhante.